Pandas 2.0 brings a very important change and that is the ability to use PyArrow as backend instead of NumPy. One of the Pandas core developer calls it a revolution as PyArrow is much faster, supports more data types, can handle null values better and so on. To test it in action, we have here a Jupyter notebook. First, we import Pandas. Then we check the version of Pandas to be at least 2.0. Then we generate a CSV file. Uh, for this, we make a function. This function generates a CSV file with five columns. The first column uh, has string. The second one has a random integer between one and, uh, one and 10, or it's ca it can be empty. Amount is a float number between 22, 22 and 99.99. And payment could be one of the four options, empty, PayPal, Visa or Master. And paid is one of the three values, true, false and empty. And we define this function. Then we call it with, uh, to generate 1 million rows. We can check it. Here we have, if we refresh, we have this CSV file. And uh, we see here the first column is invoice, is a string. The second column is items, is an integer with some null values. Amount is float. Payment could be empty. And uh, paid is a Boolean, again, could be empty. Then the next step is to read this CSV file. The first, uh, first version, we read it uh, as normal. And this takes uh, NumPy as back end. So I run it. The second time we read the same CSV file, but this time we use PyArrow as engine and PyArrow as data type back end. And if we run it, then we could compare these two. The first thing you see is that in a NumPy version, it has converted the integers to float, but in PyArrow is still integer. And we can uh, check it again with info. Run this cell and uh, check it. Invoice, payment, and paid are uh, converted to object in NumPy and integers to float. But in PyArrow is still string, string boolean, and integer. And PyArrow could handle the null values uh, natively. Then. We check how long uh, does it take the execution. And for NumPy version, it took uh, 432. And for the Pi Arrow version, it took only 26. And if we compare this together, we come to the fact that is on this machine with this uh, data set, Pi Arrow is 16 times faster than NumPy. So we come to the conclusion that uh, Pandas 2.0 with PyArrow backend is faster than Pandas with NumPy backend. To enable it, we use PyArrow as the engine and PyArrow as data type backend.